Imagine a world without blood cancer. A world free of leukemia, lymphoma, and all the other blood cancers. That was the dream of those who formed the Leukemia Research Foundation, and it remains our aspiration today. It can happen to anyone, at any time, at any age. Your sister, your mother, your husband, your neighbor, your daughter, your father, your wife, your friend, you. Blood cancers are malignant diseases in which the body produces large numbers of abnormal white blood cells that predispose patients to infection. Today, almost a million people are living with a blood cancer in the United States. Another 160,000 are diagnosed every year. Unfortunately, more than 60,000 people will die this year. Funding research is the only means to a cure. Based on recommendations from the prestigious Medical Advisory Board, the Leukemia Research Foundation exclusively funds new investigators. The Leukemia Research Foundation grant program targets investigators within seven years of becoming independent. So these are people that have completed their training and are in their first seven years. Now when somebody is normally hired by a university, they get funding for the first two or three years as part of their initial package. It should come as no surprise that many of the newest ideas and treatments of cancers are coming from young investigators. They have almost no chance of getting federal funding because uh, the funding needs a lot of preliminary data these days because of cutbacks on the federal level. So on one hand you have bright people with great ideas, on the other hand almost no chance of getting funding uh, from the federal government. We not only know that we're helping current investigators, but we've helped investigators get their careers off and running from those that first got grants 20 years ago. The Leukemia Research Foundation is unique because at least for me, it uh, gave me a chance to pursue new ideas without having a lot of the preliminary data that's otherwise required in order to get grant support. The Leukemia Research Foundation helped launch my career by giving me the funds to uh, test new ideas and develop the preliminary data and get results that were needed in order to get additional funding from the National Institutes of Health. It took 20 years from the point at which I was first motivated to begin this project until we actually found one of the genes. At any single point, one can drop the ball uh, and any kind of discontinuity in funding or other support uh, can really be disruptive and can bring an end to the whole line of research. So the Leukemia Research Foundation support was very essential because it got the project going and it sustained the effort at a very early and important stage of the investigation. Funding is very critical at this point in time. As you know, the federal government has rolled back much of the funding for biomedical research. Fortunately, there are programs like the Leukemia Research Foundation that offer hope for young investigators that don't have federal grants. The Leukemia Research Foundation provides $100,000 for these grants. This covers predominantly reagents, supplies, and technical support that the individuals need to get their projects done. It doesn't cover their salaries, the investigator's salaries. So we don't divert funds from paying salaries. We really focus on getting the funding to where it's needed, and that's the actual research project. $100,000 for one year is great. These days, with funding being so tight from governmental agencies, every little bit helps. Um, and $100,000 is actually pretty generous. You can do a lot with that kind of money. The Medical Advisory Board basically um, is a group of seasoned investigators, some of whom have already had Leukemia Research Foundation funding, who really do specialize in the area of hematologic malignancies. We have both clinicians as well as basic scientists on the board, and they meet and review the grants and assign priorities for the research projects um, and advise, if you will, the Leukemia Research Foundation and who should and should not be funded. The Leukemia Research Foundation is important to fund because it serves a complementary purpose to governmental research organizations like the National Institutes of Health. The LRF 
always keeps its eye on the prize. Behind every discovery of new medicine and treatments, there are dedicated people who make it happen. Not only can medical research prevent illness, it can cure it and improve patient care. The Leukemia Research Foundation can only be successful through the financial involvement of people like you. The ultimate success of our efforts depends on our ability to fund research that will lead to the cures. To that end, you matter a great deal. Your generous contribution provides hope for a world free of blood cancers.